Hi, I'm Lene with The Ribbon Retreat. One of the great things about making hair bows is that you get to be creative. Once you've learned a few techniques, you can create your own styles and the possibilities are endless. Today, Shirley is going to show you how to take two techniques and turn them into one adorable stacked corker hair bow. So enjoy today's video and I'll see you next week. The stacked corker bow consists of three layers. The first two layers are made using the flower loop bow technique and the top layer is a corker bow. You can find links for our YouTube tutorials for these techniques in the video description. For the first layer, or the bottom layer, we are making a flower loop bow using 7 8 inch ribbon and the straight down fold. So cut three pieces of your ribbon to 8 inches for a 3.5 inch bow. And remember to seal your ends. Also have your needle and thread ready with a knot in the end. So we're going to take our ribbon and we're going to stack it. And then we're going to fold it in half and if you're using a printed ribbon, make sure to fold it with the print on the inside. And then we're going to find the center and then take your needle and stick it through the center. You can see right there. But don't push it all the way through, just hold it right there. And then now bring the ends of the ribbon onto the needle. Okay, and then just shape it how you would like. You can see the flower forming. And then when you've got, got it the way you want, pull the needle through. And I just usually take a couple stitches. Okay and the bottom layer is done. Our next layer is using the same technique but with 5 8 inch ribbon and for this next layer we're going to cut the pieces a half an inch shorter than our bottom layer so cut three pieces of ribbon to seven and a half inches and then now form this layer using the same flower loop bow technique. Here is the finished second layer and I'm just going to put that aside. And now we're going to do the corker bow that goes on top. And you can check our video description for the link on how to make corker ribbon or you can purchase pre-made corker ribbon right here at the ribbon retreat and the pre-made ribbon is a great time saver. I'm using three different colors of 3 8 inch ribbon and you want eight to nine pieces of corker ribbon so I cut three pieces in each color and I cut them in five loops long or about two and a half inches. So take your needle and your thread and we're going to place it just in the middle of the corker and just slide it on and then just alternate your colors as you go. Okay and then take a look at it and see if you like it and how it looks the way the corkers are facing and then now just grab them together and then we're gonna stitch them together Okay, and there's your finished corker bow. Now let's put the bow together. You can stitch this bow together with your needle and thread or hot glue the layers together. I'm going to show you quickly how to hot glue them together. So this is our bottom layer with the 7 8 inch ribbon. And I'm just going to put some glue in the center. 
Now take our second layer, the 5 8 inch ribbon, and we're going to place it on. And I made sure to, to place it so you can see the 7 8 inch ribbon. Okay, and then next we'll put it on our corker bow. Okay, and then now all that's left is gluing on your lined clip. Turn that over. Okay, and then one more step that you can take is to spray your bow with stiffen stuff so it will hold its shape longer. And you can check the video description for a link to that product. And here is your finished bow. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel for a new video tutorial each week and check out our other fun tutorials. You can get all your supplies right here at theroomretreat.com where we have a huge selection, great prices, and awesome service. Thank you so much for watching.